Let's take a look at some basic techniques for using standard fluorescent and metallic paints. These paints are well suited for most designs and can also be used in combination with specialty paints from the ProGraphics line. First, let's prep the body. Thoroughly wipe down the inside of the body with isopropyl alcohol. Compressed air can be used to blow away any debris. A clean, oil-free surface will allow for optimal paint adhesion. Note that the outside of the body is covered in a protective film to prevent overspray. This will be removed at the end of the painting process to reveal the glossy finish. Prior to applying the paint, shake the can vigorously for about two minutes and double check the nozzle direction. Shake the can throughout the painting process as well. While keeping the nozzle six to eight inches from the body, firmly press down on the applicator to start the mist. Apply in thin, consistent layers while moving in a smooth side-to-side -side motion. This will help to prevent heavy spots or drips. Allow the body to dry for at least five minutes between each coat. When the desired amount of color has been applied after two or three coats and the body is fully dry, we can back the design with the solid color to enhance and protect the design. A solid white backing is commonly used, but silver or black can also be used for different effects. The backing affects the way the light is reflected back to the body and can either lighten or darken the appearance as desired. Once finished, turn any used paint cans upside down and spray for two seconds to clear the nozzle. For additional support videos or to learn more about the full line of ProGraphics RC paints, visit us at Traxxas.com.